Winning a championship is hard to do at any level, but winning five in a row? That was what the Amity baseball team was trying to do today at Palmer Field. The wreckers of Staples standing in the way of Sal Capola's team that's trying to make history. No score in the fourth inning. Bases loaded for Amity. The ground ball to second. John Nolan scores. All right. It's one nothing Spartans. In the fifth inning, here come the wreckers. Chris Durbel with the blast to center over the head of the center fielder way back there. Harris Azadian chugging all the way around from the first base. Look at him go. He's going to try and score, and he does. He's safe, and we're all tied at one. A couple batters later, Chad Knight, the pitcher, up at bat, helping himself. The deep fly to center over the wall and gone. A two run homer. It's three to one wreckers. They'd add a couple more, and they pull off the upset. There's the final out. They win it 5-1. to one. Staples with the Class Double L title, snapping Amini's 28-game postseason winning streak. An emotional day for the Wreckers head coach. You know, has it really sunk in? Because in 2015 when we came here, you know, my dad was at the game, and it was the last game he saw. And, uh, you know, so it was special, special win today. Special to come back here and play like this. It's emotional. I've been their coach for four years, and they've been my players for four years. And to have it, have it end uh, is tough. Win or lose, it would have been tough to see them leave. First time in school history that the Wreckers win the Class Double L baseball title. Class S baseball, Holy Cross beats Lyman Memorial, the SportsEdge.com crew all over this one. Go to our website for more. North Haven and Foreign play tonight for the Class L title.